Welcome to Harion Strategy. Today, my focus will be on the relationship between a business model and strategy. In one of the previous episodes, I unpacked what strategy is and why it is important. So I find it to be important to touch on a business model because a company's business model sets forth the logic for how its strategy will create value for customers and at the same time generate revenue sufficient to cover costs and realize a profit. So a business model and strategy have a direct relationship. They are codependent. So let's start with defining what a business model is. A business model is a company's blueprint for delivering a value product or service to its customers in a manner in a manner that will generate revenues sufficient to cover costs and yield an attractive profit. So in essence a business model sets out logic on how your company creates value for your defined customers and deliver it in a way that you generate revenue that exceeds the costs. The business model is made up of two elements. One, its customer value proposition and two, its profit formula. The customer value proposition lays out your company's approach to satisfying the needs and wants of your customers at a price customers will consider a good value. And the profit formula describes your company's approach to determining a cost structure that will allow for acceptable profits given the pricing tied to its customer value proposition. The profit formula can well be described using a framework called value price cost. And from this particular framework, you can Google search it. From this particular framework, you can deduce that the customer value proposition is the customer's perception of how much value they are getting for the money. And from the customer perspective, the greater the, val- the, the value delivered and the lower the price, the more attractive is the company's value proposition. On the other hand, the lower the costs of creating and delivering that attractive value proposition, the greater the ability of the business model to be a money maker. The key thing when it comes to a company's business model is whether it can execute its customer value proposition profitably. Having a well-crafted strategy for competing and running the business does not automatically mean that the strategy will lead to profitability. It depends on how efficient your business model is. So now I have some few questions for you that you can ponder on to really um, interrogate your business model to also help you review your business model and innovate on it. Here are the questions for you as a business leader. From your customer lens, from your customer's perspective, what is the value? What is it that your customers perceive as value when it comes to the product or service you're selling? Are you really giving them the value they're looking for or perhaps you need to repackage it? How much does it cost you to create and deliver value to your customers? Is there a way you can lower the cost of creating and delivering that value, but still maintain the value proposition? How can you maximize your profits with the model that you're using? I hope those few questions, they help you to really review your business model. I implore you to review your business model and find a way to reinvent it so that you can have a winning business model. In the next episode, we'll be starting with our business um, strategic planning process, which will be a series where we'll be taking you through steps on how to formulate a strategy for your business. So in essence, from the beginning to the end of this series, at the end of the series, you should be able to have a working strategic plan for your business.